Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Helpy. How are you? I'm fine. Fine. Good evening, Hello, teacher. teacher. Good evening, Carlos. Good evening. Uh, yeah, I mean, for the rest, how how's everything, people? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo les va? Everything is okay? How is everything in, in the work? Good evening. Hello, good evening. Yo tengo cierre, teacher. Uh, Ahora y mañana. Día difícil en mi trabajo. Día ah, difícil. Difficult day, really? Sí. sí well, but, I mean, but, eh, pero por lo general llega temprano a su casa. ¿A la misma no. hora? Solo ahora vine temprano. Mañana sí voy a salir tarde, creo. Ah, okay. Generally get late tomorrow. Mm. Pero siempre me conectaré. Ah, okay, you will be connected. That's cool. That's good to, to, to hear. <laughs> okay, that's great. All right, how about the rest? ¿Qué tal? ¿Y los demás? Like, are you at home already? Hi, right? teacher. Hi, mister. How's everything? I'm taking my dinner right now. Ah, okay, cool, man. Enjoy it. Thank you. Man. Okay, that's great. That's nice. All right, so we're going to start with the things that we got for, you know, like for tonight. If you remember today, we're going to have the class number 13, right? So this is going to be the video conference number 13. And today we're going to continue with uh, the topics that we were discussing previously uh, yesterday. Uh, so it's not going to be like that difficult to you, you know, like to get along with those type of things, right? Because it's something that we have been practicing, right? Without any problem. So before starting with, with the things that we're going to have for tonight, I am going to press the attendance list. So in that way, we are going, you know, like to start, right? Just to start. Give me one second. Teacher. Yes. Tengo un poco de problema con el inter porque yo lo veo todo cortado. Really? O sea, soy yo, no sé si soy yo o... Oh, oh, is it me? Uh, ¿Los demás me escuchan perfecto o, o me escuchan medio cortado? Como... Es que sí le escucho, lo único es la imagen, nada más que lo veo así cortado. Ah, ah pues sí, creo que sí, es, es, es su internet. Yeah, probably it's your internet. Aunque igual a usted sí lo veo bien. I mean, se está moviendo bien and everything, así como veo a los demás. Like, everything is going good up to now. Hi, teacher. Hi, uh, soy la, how's everything? ¿Cómo está todo, soy la? Bien, o sea, Dios. Perfect. Cansada, teacher, pero ah, bien. Tired, but good. I mean, that's good. That's great. All right. That's perfect. Okay, cool. So we're going to start with the things. Uh, and William, cuando terminemos la clase, eh, lo que puede hacer, si, si persisten los problemas, a veces no es el internet, sino más bien, a veces hay actualizaciones de Zoom. Y cuando hay actualizaciones pendientes, por lo general suelen dar fallas. Tal es el caso como las clases anteriores que estaba, me, me habían estado fallando. Aparentemente había una actualización de Zoom. Entonces, eh, y el internet me estaba funcionando al máximo, ok, porque lo estuve testeando después, like, I, I was like, like, you know, checking it, and it was, it was good, man, it was good, pero Zoom no me lo levantaba, and I, and I don't know why, era medio raro eso, so probably it might be that, ok, in your, in your case, ok, so let's just start, people, I'm going to pass the attendance list, and then we're going to move to the things that we're going to have for tonight, ok, let's start over, so Carlos Mauricio, Present. Okay, great. Uh, Cindy Melanie. Ah, yeah, I mean, Cindy's not here. Elby Quintanilla. Hi, teacher, present. Okay, nice. Uh, Stephanie Michelle. Michelle, are you there? Present. Ah, okay, nice. Present. 
Thank you, Gustavo Adolfo. Uh, that was definitely not here, right? Uh, Ivania Jamilet. Present teacher. Ah, okay, perfect. Jorge Alberto. No, okay, not here. Jose Antonio. Present. Okay, perfect. Jose Edgar. Present. Okay, very good. Let's move Juan Emanuel. Okay, it's not here yet. Juan Gilberto. Hmm, Juan Gilberto, okay, he's not here. Let's move Julio Alberto. Julio Alberto, are you there? Ah, okay, all right. Next, Julio Cesar. Is this Cesar here? Okay, not here. All right, let's move. Uh, Karen Beatriz. Ah, okay, Karen, I, I apparently, uh, she might, might have problems or something. Ah, uh, Luis Gerardo. Luis Gerardo, okay, cool, it's not here. Let's move, Veronica Arely. Present. Ah, okay, great. That's nice, just give me one second. Okay, let's move, uh, Wendy Jamilet. Present. Ah, okay. Okay. Cool, man. That's nice. Uh, let's move. Uh, William Ernesto. Presente. Okay, perfect. Let's move. Xiomara Elizabeth. Present. Okay, excellent. Uh, Luis Jonathan. Present teacher. Okay, great. Uh, Carlos Jose. Present teacher. Okay, nice. And the last one, soy la Guadalupe. Present teacher. No, okay, there you go. All right, so let's just start with the things that we're gonna be doing, you know, for today. Uh, what was the last last thing that we were practicing yesterday? ¿Cuál era el tema que estábamos practicando? Uh, you know, like yesterday, um, as the main topic. Let's see if you remember, guys. Present continuous. Continuous. All right. Present continuous. And that was it. Simple present. And simple present. Ah, okay. Present continuous and simple present. Those the those were the ones that we were practicing. You know, like yesterday, right? Cool. Mm, just to start, when do we use? Simple present, William. Eh, es una acción que estoy haciendo. Como por ejemplo, I play in soccer. Ajá, uh -huh. ok, all right. That's an action that you're doing in the moment of speaking, all right? That's the, yeah. main, uh, that's the main thing that we, that we get to, to, to remember in here, ok? That's the thing that we can say, all right? Listen up. You can say, look. We use... Present continuous to talk about actions that are happening at the moment of speaking. Okay, es para hablar de acciones. Okay, para hablar de acciones que están sucediendo al momento en que hablamos, verdad? That's present continuous. Right? Very good. Now, what about simple present? Elvi, when do we use simple present? Elvi, are you there? Son como para, uh, son las rutinas. Ah, okay. How would you say that in English? ¿Y ¿Cómo lo diría en inglés? 
Uh, I, I drink coffee, I, ha, I take shower, I take a shower. Um, I go to work. Now, nah, okay, okay, all right. Those are routines, right? Daily routines that we generally use with those, uh, with that structure, okay, cool. So let's remember, simple present, we use, we use it to talk about actions that are okay para hablar de acciones que son rutinarias para nosotros right for example the one that you say uh, if you write down a series of examples you might say I take a shower every day right I go to work, all right? I clean the house. Those are actions that are used as something routinary, right? But what happened in present continuous? Since they are actions that are happening at the moment of speaking, let's remember that part. So in that case, what do we generally do? Ah, we write down actions in the moment that you're talking about. For example, I can say, I am, let's remember, teaching English, right? I am speaking English. I am typing on the computer, you see? So in that case, uh, those are actions that are happening at the moment, right? So, estas son acciones que están sucediendo en el momento en el que yo estoy hablando, right? So, recordemos entonces, present continuous, actions in the moment. Simple presence, routinary actions, right? Acciones rutinarias. Okay, that's what we generally talk about, right? So, that's the way how we work with this type of structures, right? Cool. Now, in order to continue with the things that we are going to be doing like right now, okay? What are those actions that we generally do? All right. Oh, what are those actions that we frequently do in that case? Now, I want you to give me one example using simple present, right? Besides the ones that LB gave to me. Aparte de los ejemplos que LB me dio, me gustaría que me dieran por lo menos un ejemplo a ustedes. Uno, en presente simple y uno en presente continuo. Profe, quiero, quiero hacer una pregunta de un presente simple que me okay. confundió en la plataforma. Ajá, a ver. Dice, I like driving to work. Ajá, I like driving to work. Ajá, ah, entonces, eso, 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 eso es... Pre quiero. All right, that's simple present. Ese es presente simple. Ajá. Ok, en este caso, listen. Existen verbos, ok, existen verbos en los cuales, escuche bien, dos verbos en una oración no pueden ir en forma base. ¿Ok? Dos verbos en una oración no pueden ir de forma base. Si tengo el verbo like y tengo el verbo drive, like y drive no pueden ir así, tal y como se dicen. Like and drive. Usted dice que tenía I like driving, ¿verdad? To work. Ok, así es. Ok, cool. Hay una regla que dice que el verbo like, por lo general, si hay otro verbo que precede al verbo like, tal es el caso del verbo drive, estos dos verbos no pueden estar juntos, así. O sea, los dos en forma base, like, drive, porque son, es incorrecto. Por lo general, el segundo verbo tiene que cambiar. El segundo verbo se transforma en gerundio. ¿Cuándo es un gerundio? Cuando le agregamos ing. Entonces ya la oración tiene que decir I like driving to work. All right? En este caso no significa que yo estoy hablando en presente continuo. ¿Ok? Que, me, que, que diga me gusta, estoy manejando o algo por el estilo. No. En este caso es me gusta manejar al trabajo. Ok, aquí no hay nada de presente y continuo. Entonces, pero sin embargo, el segundo verbo tiene que ir con ING. 
porque es, un, es parte de una regla que nos indica que el segundo verbo o va en infinitivo o va en gerundio. ¿Cómo es en infinitivo? También se puede formar en infinitivo. ¿Cómo así? I like to drive to work. Acá yo ya tengo la, el verbo en infinitivo. ¿Y cómo es infinitivo? Agregándole la preposición to al verbo. Por lo general, al segundo verbo. ¿Ok? No the first one, no el primero, sino más bien el segundo. Entonces, existe una gran variedad de verbos que podemos hacerlo de esta manera. Por ejemplo, ¿cómo dice usted ir de compras? Por lo general tiene go, que es el verbo ir. ¿Y cuál es el verbo de comprar? Shop. ¿Ok? Shop es comprar o compras. Go shopping, ir de compras. ¿Y sí? Por lo general se le agrega ING. ¿Ok? Otro, otra, otra ocasión, en, o, o otro verbo, por así decirlo. Tenemos el verbo love. Amar o, o para decir like. Me encanta hacer algo. ¿Ok? Yo puedo decir, look, I love teaching English. I love teaching English. Si ve acá, tengo el verbo teach. Pero después, antes del verbo teaching, right, el verbo teach con ing, tengo love. Significa que después de love, el siguiente verbo que yo coloque acá, tiene que ir con ing. Right? Y aquí dice, ah, me encanta enseñar inglés. You see? Entonces acá, el segundo verbo es el que por lo general se modifica. Entonces, por eso es que va a haber usted ciertos verbos con ing después de, otros, de, después de otro verbo. Right? Pero estos no son nada que ver con el, el presente continuo. Right? Siempre siguen siendo simple present. No sé si me da entender, okay. Carlos. Ok, ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. No, ok. Claro. Ok, nice. So, let's continue with this. Uh, uh, I told you, right? I told you to give me one example using simple present and present continuous. I don't know if you have them already. No sé si ya tenemos los ejemplos. Sí. Okay. There you go. Wendy. Bye. Present simple. Uh -huh. I check my emails every day. Okay, cool. En present eh, presente continuo. Eh, I am planning eh, my activities every day. Ah, ok. Very good. Thank you, Wendy. There you go. Thank you. Ok, cool. Somebody else? Finish, teacher. All right, Carlos. Eh, en continuos, I drinking coffee every night. I drinking or I am drinking? I am drinking coffee. Very good. Y en present, en present simple, I eat one semita every night. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With coffee? All right. That's cool, With coffee. Man. That's good, cool, man. That's nice, Carlos. Perfect. Thank you. All right. Somebody else? Alguien más? Somebody else has already finished? Bye. I study English in this moment. Present simple. I am studying English, ¿verdad? I study English. Yo estudio inglés en este momento. Present ah, simple. Pero, uh, present simple. Simple present. Ok. Uh -huh. eh, 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 eh. Solo coloque, solo, solo eliminemos in this moment. Usted póngalo, I study English. Estudio okay. inglés. Ok. okay. Yo estoy en inglés. La otra sí la puede poner in this moment. Ah, le puse. I am learning English every day. Ah, ese every day, páselo al simple present. Y en in this moment, páselo al presente continuo. Ah, ok. Thank yes. You. Ok, cool, Fabio. Thank you. Bueno. All right, somebody else? Yo, teacher. All right, Michelle, let's go on. Uh, I am cooking dinner every day. Okay. Y I check my TikTok in the night. 
my TikTok. Okay. <laughs> It's do you, okay. Do you dance on that? No, no, no. Solo me gusta ver. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y están bien. ¿Ah? Están bien las oraciones. Ya, yeah, men. <laughs> uh. okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. Ya, yeah, men. Uh. Okay, Michelle. That's cool, that's cool. Ya yeah, aparecer Michelle en un video, ¿no? Right? On TikTok, like dancing. Right? <laughs> that's, that's funny, man. That's funny. Okay. Somebody else? Yo, teacher. Okay, William. Let's go on. I take a shower at 6 a.m. every day. Ah, okay. Uh, I go to the home. I go home. I go home. But I go y home. Po, y po, y po también, I go home right now. Uh, but in that case, the second one is simple present, right? Okay. Okay, cool. Uh, can you read the, the other one? Uh, I, el, uh, I take a shower at no, the end. No, no, the other one, the other one. The ultimate, ah, pues, I go to the, I go to home. I go home. Ajá, I go home. Quise, quise poner, también, también se, se podía poner I go home right now, como voy para la casa ahora mismo. No sé si sería se entra como, uh, si la como presente. Poner, si la quieres poner como progresivo, present progressive, tendría que ser I am going home right now. Ah, uh, uh, ok. Entonces, normal, normalmente así, para presente continuo, solo I go home. Uh, I mean, simple present. 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 Uh -huh. Yes, present continuous, ya agregamos el verbo to be y el verbo go pasaría a go. going. going. Sí. Sí, ahí es presente siempre. Sí, pues. uh, okay. okay. Yeah, I mean. Thank you, William. Ajá, Elvi. Present continuous, no, ahí dice, I am sending emails. I am sending emails, all right? That's an action that you're doing in the moment of speaking, right? Very good. Thank you, Elvi. Okay, somebody else? Alguien más? Yo, teacher. All right, Jonathan. Uh, present continuo is uh, she is working a lot like tele. No, okay. All right. Acceptable. And simple present? Uh, they, they, they don't run in the park. They don't run in the park. Okay, very good. That's a, actually, that's a negative statement, right? Yes, una oración negativa. I mean, that's pretty cool. Okay, teacher. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Jonathan. Somebody else? Alguien más? What happened with the rest of the people? Are you there, people? All right, Gilberto, go on. Presente continuo. Aha. I am listening to the English class. Ah, okay. Y presente simple. Uh -huh. I, I cooking in the morning. I am cooking? In the morning. Mm, okay, very good. I am cooking in the morning. Very good, Gilberto. Okay. All right. Somebody else? For the ones who got the cameras on, off. Para los que tienen la cámara apagada. Do you have them? Yes. Okay, cool. Let's read it, Jose. I Bruce, I Bruce made this after taking a shower. Ah, okay, I brushed my teeth after taking a shower. Very good. Sería presente. Sería presente, ¿verdad? Simple present, yes, that, that's correct. The other one would be, but made pet on Sunday. Uh, can you read it again, please? Pet, but made pet pet on Sunday. <clears throat> uh, that one is simple present or present continuous? Continuous. Uh, no sé si está bien. 
Eh, Dale una vez más, es que casi no lo escucho. Sería baño mi perro, no, 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 baño mi mascota el domingo. Ah, pero esa sería simple present. Esa sería presente mm. simple, ¿ok? Si yo digo baño mi mascota en los domingos o el domingo, es presente simple. Ahí no podría decir... estar usando el, el, el verbo to be. Es básicamente eh, una acción en el momento que se puede estar haciendo. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo, yo puedo decir, ah, estoy dando clase. Right? That's an action in the moment. Entonces, es una acción que está sucediendo en el instante en el que yo estoy hablando, por así decirlo. Ajá. Okay. Aparte, tenemos que llevar el verbo to be, ya sea como am, is, or, y el verbo principal en ing. Ok. Right. So o sea, por, por ejemplo, por decir, digamos, eh, estoy leyendo un libro. Ajá. Libro de leyendas. Ajá. So in that case, do you want me to translate it or do you want me to help you out with, with each word? Um, word. Ah, yeah, I mean, that's a legend book. A book of legends. Right? So, but in that case, you might say, I am reading. Así sería, sería eh, eh, lo que usted comentó. Look, así me. I am reading. Okay. A book of Legends or a Legends book. Okay, ese All sí right. sería en presente continuo. Es correcto. That's right. Because okay. An action I'm doing in the moment of speaking. Gracias, right. teacher. Okay, Jose. Cool. Somebody else? Alguien más? Yo. Yo, teacher. All right, Ivania, and then Carlos. Okay. Um, I send the report by mail in the afternoon. Okay. A, I am listening music of Brian Adams. Ah, okay, very good. I'm listening to music of Brian Adams. Very nice. Pretty acceptable. All right, uh, Mr. Gamero. As I'm continuing, I am having classes the English right now. Okay, I am having English classes right now. I wash my car this Saturday. On Saturdays. All right, and this is the Saturday. It's on. On Saturday. Very good. Thank you, Carlos. All right, I uh, guess for the rest. Ooh, do, 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 do. Let me see. All right, these people got the camera, so probably they are doing something. Okay, let's continue with these things, people. Now I'm going to stop sharing this because I need to show you something. Give me one second. Okay, there you go. So this is the video conference number 13. Let's remember that. Today's topic is going to be present continuous with WH question. ¿Qué significa? Vamos a seguir hablando del presente continuo. Solo que en esta vez ya no vamos a hablar sobre oraciones positivas, sino como así. Vamos a hablar sobre oraciones negativas, right? Eh, in that case, en algunas, uh, algunos tramos. Pero lo más, ahora va a ser cómo usar WH words, ¿ok? In that case, para crear preguntas, right, using the present continuous. Ahora nos vamos a enfocar más que todo en cómo crear preguntas, right? That's going to be the whole topic about. All right, what do we got for this uh, video conference? We got the review from the previous topic, lo que acabamos de básicamente hacer. The present continuous using WH words. 
that's the main thing that we're going to be discussing tonight. Then we're going to have some exercises in the manual, and then we're going to check those exercises in the manual, right? Ahora sí vamos a estar revisando un poco, all right? Uh, más lo del manual. Uh, you, you, you know what I mean. We got to practice over there, right? Now, the present continuous. This is something that you have already, you know, like, in mind. Let's see. Who can help me out ready? Give me one second. Hmm. Soila, help me out ready. Ahorita, perdón. Okay. okay. In present continuous. In English, present continuous can be used to describe what is happening now. Mm -hmm. Example, example, I am studying now. She is watching TV. Mm -hmm. Or television. Or television. Emily is, is texting to her boss. Uh -huh. Julie, se vea. Yes, Julio. Julio and Daniel are doing their homework. Okay, very good. Thank you, Soila. It says, listen, in English, a present continuous can be used to describe what is happening at the moment of speaking, right? Or now. We got some examples over there as uh, Soila was reading. We got, I am studying now, right? Ah, estoy estudiando ahora, right? She's watching television. Ah, ella está viendo televisor, oh, televisión, I mean, perdón. Emily is texting to her boss, right? So in the moment, Emily is grabbing the phone and I start texting to, you know, like her boss, right? And then we got the last one. It says, Julio and Daniel, right, are doing their homework. So in this case, right, and an action, right, is being done. And one is basically the action that is happening in that case. Ah, they are basically doing the homework. Okay, this is pretty much what we are going to be discussing okay for the rest of this class about actions you know that are happening at the moment of speaking right that's pretty much what we are going to be you know talking about cool i hope we have understood this part because we are going to continue it says present continuous with wh word Okay, let's remember, in this case, when we talk about WH words, we, we are talking about those words that we generally start a question with. What are those WH words that I mentioned? You got what, what time, where, when, right, who, and why. Those are like the time, uh, you know, like the, the, the WH words that we generally use to start a question. But let's see the structure and all those things. Check that, check out the structure. It says WH word as a, in everything, right? So we start a question. If you want to make an open question, you have to start with the WH word. It says plus B, right? Plus B, let's remember, when we talk about B, we are basically talking about uh, um, is and are, okay? Then we got the subject, okay? After the subject, we have the verb in ing, right? We have the verb in ing. And after that, we have a complement. Let's remember, the complement is only, you know, like, to make a sentence more specific, right? And that's it. Just to make a sentence more specific. We have one example in here. Let me see who can help me already. Alguien que tenga la cámara para vale. Jorge Alberto, I'm gonna start with you. Okay, Jorge, help me a reading, please, the question. 
Okay. Uh, where are you playing the piano right now? Ah, okay. Very good. Where are you playing the piano right now? Okay. Ah, donde estás tocando el piano en estos momentos, right? So that's the one that it says in here. So this is a question. Si bien ven, básicamente el verbo to be va justo después de, eh, básicamente, va justo después de la puesta de la WH word, ok, y después del verbo be se coloca el subject. Recordemos, después, right, del verbo to be se coloca el subject, y el subject va a ir de acorde a la forma del verbo to be, ok. Si ahí no tuviéramos you y tuviéramos she, so, en ese caso, ¿cuál sería? Ah, sería is, right? The case. Let's remember that. Now, we have an answer to this question. Yes, we have it there. Xiomara, help me reading. I am playing the piano in the concert right now. Very good. I am playing the piano in the concert right now, right? So, in that case, this is an answer, you know, to the question that we got about it. Okay, now, what are those common WS words that we generally use to create questions? Check this. Okay, we got what, when, why, what time, what time, listen up, and which. Okay, so that's the one, all right? Those are the WS words that we generally use, okay, to start questions, okay? And the last ones, we got where and we got who. Where and who, okay? De estas WS words que tenemos acá, ¿hay alguna que no conozcamos del todo? Which... Which, which is para decir cuál. Right, okay. that is which, all right? Just to, just to say, all right, uh, something on the song. Okay, let's remember, what is cuando mencionamos que. When, cuando, why, por qué, which, quién, who, all right, I mean, cuál, which, who, quién, where, donde, what time, a qué horas, right? So those are like the most common, you know, WH words that we generally use, okay? With, right, uh, with this structure. There you go. If you want, you can take notes about this and then we're going to continue, okay? Si gustan, tomen nota de eso o tomen una screenshot, right? And then we are going to move. Para luego pasar a la siguiente diapositiva. Just let me know. When do you finish, okay? Just give me one second. Okay. There you go, you finish? Yes. Yes. Okay, cool. Let's continue. Finish. Nice, man. let's continue. Okay, now we got some examples, all right? We got some examples. Gilberto, help me out reading this one. What are you doing? Okay, what are you doing? Ah, ¿qué estás haciendo, right? Okay, I give my answer. Julio Alberto. I am preparing my class. Ah, okay, I am preparing my class. Very good. Next question. Let's see, Veronica. Why are you listening to rock music? Okay, very good. Why are you listening to rock music? And it says, uh, let's see, William. 
I am listening to rock music because I like it. Okay, very good. I am listening to rock music because I like it. Okay, that's a brief explanation to the question using why. Now, next question, Michelle. Uh, who is she talking to? Talking to. Okay, who is talking okay. Who is she talking to? Okay. ¿A quién le está hablando ella? Right? That is the translation from this in a, a question. Now, the answer. Let me see. Julio Alberto, let's say it. She is talking to her mother. Okay, she is talking to her mother, right? Ah, ella está hablando con su mamá. So in that case, we can continue with that. Now, one second. I think some of you have not uh, finished already with these things. Okay, now listen. Copy this information because later on, we are going to do a short practice related to this WH course, right? I need to know how much are we understanding this part, but write them down, question and answer. Profe, in the case of the first question, what, what, what are you doing? Uh -huh. In the answer that any person has to go to Gerundio. Exactly. Y otra cosa, ahí va a depender de la acción que usted está haciendo, así va a ser el verbo que va a colocar. En esa, sí, ese es el tipo de preguntas en el cual usted pregunta con un verbo y le responden con otro verbo, que no es el verbo de la pregunta. ¿Ok? ¿Por qué? Porque literal la pregunta dice, ¿qué estás haciendo? ¿Ok? So, in that case, if you say, like, ah, what are you doing? ¿Qué estás haciendo? So, in that case, Usted puede decir, I am teaching English. Ah, estoy enseñando inglés. I am learning English. Ah, estoy aprendiendo inglés. You see, I am cooking the food. Ah, estoy cocinando la comida. So you see, in that case, dependiendo del, de, de, de lo que usted vaya a mencionar, así va a ser, ok, el verbo que va a utilizar. Ok, mister. So that's why we use is that one right okay cool hasta acá tenemos alguna otra pregunta alguna otra duda con respecto a cómo formular este tipo de preguntas no no okay cool para los que tienen para la mitad de la clase que tienen la cámara apagada please let's turn it on please encendámosla right i know some of you okay. might, might not be there okay but let's try to do it. Let's try to do it. Okay, cool. Now, I'm going to be asking one question to all of you people. So in that way, let's see if you have understood this thing. Okay, cool. If I ask you, Soila, what are you doing? What would you be your answer? I am... Um, I am studying English. I am studying English. Okay, very good. Thank you, Soyla. Now, LB. Okay. LB, where are you drinking a soda? Mm. No me gusta la soda, como puedo decir? I not. I mean, yeah, it's a random example, no problem. Okay. I am. I am drinking. Coffee. I am drinking. Drinking, drinking coffee. No, ah, okay. so. <laughs> okay, coffee, coffee. Coffee. I am drinking coffee. Uh -huh. The question was, okay, where, where are you drinking coffee? All right, I'm going to show you two coffee. Repeat the answer. I, uh, I am drinking coffee in... In the morning? No, where, where, location, location, Elvin. Mm. You may say, 
Okay, I am drinking coffee in the cafe. I am drinking coffee in my house. Uh, I am drinking uh, coffee in my okay. office. Okay. I okay. am I am drinking coffee in my office. Ah, okay. very good. There you go. Okay. Nice. Let me see another person. Uh Carlos. Uh Chavez. Hello, teacher. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Who is writing a letter? Esa pregunta no, no está aquí, ah. ¿verdad? En, en ejemplos. Nah. Okay. That's directly okay. to you. Who is writing a letter? Uh, Susan is reading this letter. Uh, nah, listen, 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 Carlos. Who is writing a letter? Writing, uh -huh. writing. Uh -huh. uh, my answer for you is, for example, Susan is, is writing the letter. Ah, okay, very good. There you go. Thank you, Carlos. So in that case, okay. that's the way how we ask this type of questions, right? And how you answer to this type of questions also using okay the previous wh words that you got in there okay that's the one okay cool now listen up what are we going to be doing with this si no hay ninguna pregunta okay si todo está quedando claro okay let's do something vamos a hacer algo listen me interesa que este tema vaya quedando un poco claro, ¿cómo así? Porque este tema está basado más que todo en preguntas, respuestas, right? Ya sea en primera o en tercera persona. Questions and answers. That's going to be the one that we're going to be working on. Ahora bien, quiero que me hagan una pregunta antes de iniciar la, la actividad principal. Una pregunta, ¿ok? Can be about anything, pero tiene que ser en presente continuo. Usando cualquiera de las WH words que acabamos de ver hace una diapositiva anterior, ¿ok? Ya sea usando what, where, when, what time, why, all right? Pero solo la pregunta, no problem, with the question. We are going to be answering here. Okay, teacher, finish. Okay, very good. What about the rest? Finish teacher. Ah, okay, Jonathan. Finish teacher. Perfect. Finish. Okay, let's wait for the other one. Finish this. Okay, perfect. Finish. Okay, very good. Okay. Finished. All right, perfect. Okay, cool. Let me see, are you very home? Where is the angry dog, man? <laughs> Ah, ya sabemos. Ok, cool. What is the name of your dog, Elvi? Hola. What is, what is the name of your dog? Where do you run in the morning? Ah, no, 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 no. Ah. Listen, listen. What is the name of your dog? Ay, Duncan. 
Duncan. Ok, that's, 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 Duncan. <laughs> that's a good name, man. Interesante Duncan. nombre. Duncan Patricio se llama. Duncan Patricio. <laughs> ok, that's cool, man. that's cool. El apellido le falta, le dije. Quintanilla es. Quintanilla. Ok. There you go. Ok, cool. Listen up. Now, what are we going to do? Now, we're going to have those questions that you have already in here. Listen. Como hay algunos que todavía uh, no comprenden los verbos en algunas ocasiones que, que solemos estar haciendo, listen, quiero que me escriban su pregunta, la que han hecho, ok, simplemente transcríbanla y pónganmela en el chat del grupo, ok, one time, la que tienen, solo transcríbanla en el grupo para que así al momento de la práctica ya sepamos cuál uh, uh, pregunta es la que están haciendo. Ahora sí, y los demás, you know, like, sepan cómo contestar. Todo la ponemos en el chat. Only one, only one. Toda la pregunta. This is one question, okay? All right, just give me one second. Teacher, pero me dice si está bien. Ah. Ok, give me one second. Ah, 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 ah. Ok, pónganlas ahí y las vamos a corregir todas, ok? On the spot, no problem. I'm gonna be putting it there uh, with no problem. We are doing justice. All right, Jonathan, what do you want to write in that case? Jonathan? Come in a pregunta in Spanish, Jonathan. Uh... Sperm. All right. Yeah, because because in that case, uh, it's missing. All right, it's missing the question form, porque falta la estructura de la pregunta, right? En ese caso, porque vaya, literalmente, uh, si fuese una pregunta, yo no tan sería el R primero y después el we y el símbolo de pregunta. Sería el R primero. Y después we. Uh, are we do, do you, doing justice? Justice, exactly. Teacher. Okay, teacher. All right. está, está bien esta pregunta. Si está formulada correctamente. Where, where are you running in the morning? Where are you running in the morning? Está malo. Permítame que todos están poniendo en el morning. <laughs> Jimmy, va a ser. La mía está buena. Ahorita en eso estoy, estoy revisando. Listen, listen, listen. Técnicamente las preguntas están correctas, solo que hay algo que vamos a eliminar. Ah, miren, como estamos hablando de estructuras que se están desarrollando en el momento, eh, para eso es que me han puesto in the morning, quitemos esa parte, in the morning. ¿Por qué? Porque ya no es una acción que estamos desarrollando en el instante que estamos hablando. ¿Ok? Entonces ahí como que nos quita ese, ese, esa parte. Si yo digo ahorita, I am teaching English in the morning, estoy enseñando inglés en la mañana, 
ah, significa que la acción no la estoy desarrollando en el instante, ahorita. ¿Ok? Entonces, por lo tanto, no puede ser presente continuo, sino que ya, ya estamos expresando probablemente el futuro. ¿Se acuerdan al principio de, de la semana? Cuando estábamos mencionando el presente continuo para expresar el futuro. Right. So, in that case, it's pretty similar to that. Así que solo eliminemos el in the morning. Ajá, José. Tengo una. Dice. Una. Voy a decir. Dice. Mm -hmm. What time do you sleep this day? Mm -hmm. Póngale mejor. What time are you sleeping? Con ING. What time are you sleeping? Are you sleep? sleeping? Okay. What time are it? Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? Jesus, man. And everybody has problems with the connection. Okay. Cool. Okay. Okay. Cool, man. Are we doing justice? All right, Jonathan, solo le falta el símbolo de pregunta. Okay. All right. Give me one second. Teacher, la que puse yo está mal estructurado o le hace falta algo o le quito algo. Ahorita estoy revisando. Give me one second. All right, it says, are we doing justice? Esa es una yes, no question, Jonathan. Solo le falta el símbolo. Okay. Why is you eating pineapple? Michelle. Michelle. Está mala. Yes, Michelle. ¿Por qué? Porque usted no dice you is, Michelle. ¿Qué dice usted por lo general? You is or you are? Ah, ah. Ah, entonces eliminemos R, eliminemos y si colocamos is. R. Ah, okay. Why are you eating pineapple? Okay. Where are you running? Bye. All right, LB, running con doble N. Ok. Cool. Where are you swimming right now? Cool, Jorge. That was excellent. Carlos Gamero, what time are we class of English teacher. today? Give me one second. Okay. Me equivoqué en la redacción. Sí, le falta el verbo, le falta el verbo, Carlos. Sí, es, que, es que quería, pues, no le puse el having. Ah, ok, colóqueselo entonces. Elvi, where are you running? Ah, la primera me puso la doble en el, en la segunda estía, no la puso. Ok. Thanks. What are you having for dinner? Okay, cool, Julio. Alberto. What are you having for dinner? Bien, teacher. Yes, man, it's okay. Okay. When is she going to the supermarket? Okay, cool, William. Where are you taking your lunch? Very good, Xiomara. Where are you swimming in the morning? Uh, why are you learning English? Very good, Soila. Hmm. Why are you going to the park? All right. The one that Veronica did is correct too. Pero creo que Veronica se le fue el internet. I mean, a lot of people are having problems with the internet, and it's I just have 14 students out of uh, like 23. Man, nine people are missing. Jesus, what happened to these people? Okay, but anyways, let's continue. Let's continue. It says, uh, what time are we having the class of English today? <laughs> okay, le eliminémosle el today, Carlos. Para que no suene que es a futuro, ¿ok? Where is she buying the clothes? Very good, Elvin. I mean, that's another one, right? Ok, cool. Ok, cool. So we got the questions there. Bien. Entonces, ahora que ya tenemos las preguntas ahí, vamos a leerlas. 
how come? Las vamos a leer y las vamos a contestar acá mismo. Ok? Without any problem. But give me one second. Give me one second. I'm going to stop in here for a moment. And I am going to, uh, to, to, to pass the attendance list because it's time. Let me see. Carlos Mauricio. Present. Okay, cool. Cindy Melanie. Uh, Cindy, I think she had problems with the internet. Elvi Quintanilla. Hi, teacher. Okay, perfect. Stephanie Michelle. Present. Okay, Gustavo Adolfo. Ivania Yamilet. Present, teacher. Okay. Jorge Alberto. Present, teacher. Ah, okay. José Antonio. Present. Ok. José Edgar. Present. All right. Juan Emanuel. Ok, he's not here. Juan Gilberto. A mí me da problemas de ir en También tu problemas de conexión. Julio Alberto. Ah, ok, very good. Let's move. Julio César. Julio César. All right, he's not here. Karen Beatriz. All right, she's not here. Uh, Luis Gerardo. Luis Gerardo, is he here? No, no, here. Let's move, Veronica Arely. Okay, neither Veronica, she had problems with the internet. Wendy Yamilet. Present. Okay, very good. William Ernesto. Present. Okay, perfect. Let's move. Tomar Elizabeth. Present. Ok, nice. Luis Jonathan. Present teacher. Ok, good. Let's move. Carlos José. Present teacher. And the last one, soy la Guadalupe. Ok, cool. Now, Elvi. I want you to read the question and I want Soyla to answer that question. So pay attention one with the other one, ok? Where are you running? Where are you running? Okay, very good. Where are you running? Why are you learning English? Ah, no, Soyla. Give me the answer to that question. Deme la respuesta de la pregunta que hizo Elvi. Uh, repeat, Elvi, please. Where are you running? I am running. Running es corriendo, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes. Yes. I am running in the park. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, Soyla, read the question. And Xiomara is going to answer that question. Okay. <clears throat> why, why, why are you learning English? Very good. I'm learning English because I like it. Okay, very good. Very nice answer, uh, uh, Xiomara. Okay, so let, thank you. Now, Xiomara, read your question and Carlos Gamero is going to answer. Okay. Where do you take in your lunch? Uh, repeat again, Soyla. I mean, uh, Xiomara. Where are you taking your lunch? Ah, okay, very good. Very good.
Ha. I am taking my lunch mm -hmm. in the work. Very good. Thank you, Carlos. All right, that's, that's cool. Now, read the question that you have, Carlos, and Julio Alberto. Are you busy, Julio? Okay, cool. William is going to answer. Okay. What time are we having the class of English? Okay. Casi no, casi no escuché muy bien la pregunta. Okay, what time? What, what time? Uh, what time? Are we having the class of English? Very good. Perdón, teacher. No sé si soy yo, pero fíjese que solo le escucho what time nada más. Okay. Y ahí se, yo quizá no sé si soy yo. Uh, are you listening to me right now? Sí, yes, that, yes. Yes, yes. Okay, dice él, what time are you having your class of English? What time are you having? The class of English or the English class. I having, I have, I have, I have, I have class. Okay, remember, I am. I am having class. 8 p.m. at 8 p.m. Okay, all right, it's valid, even though you are missing like some of the items that are in the general question, but it's okay, it's still okay. Thank you, Carlos. Now, William, with your question, hola, hola. And Carlos Chavez is going to answer. Okay, uh, what time is she preparing the dinner? Very good. She is preparing the dinner at 9 p.m. o'clock. Okay, cool, at 9 p.m. o'clock. Oh, at 9 p.m. Thank you, William. Now, Carlos, read the question, and I want uh, Stephanie Michelle to read. Okay, my, my question. Yes. Did you? Yeah, yeah, your question. My question is, where is paying the internet? Mm, okay. Where is he or she? Where is where is paying the internet? Ajá, pero ahí literal está diciendo dónde está pagando el, eh, eh, uh, el internet. Pero, ¿quién? ¿Quién está pagando? Uh, where is where is where is uh, okay? Uh, le hago una pregunta directa yo a, en, en este caso a, a Michelle. Ah, si es una pregunta directa, entonces es en primera persona y usted va a decir where are you? Uh, where 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 you where are, are you paying uh -huh. the internet? Okay, very good. Um, I am paying internet in Lourdes. In Lourdes. Okay, cool. Thank you, Carlos. Now, Michelle, read your question and... Ah, Veronica is here. Nice, man. Cool. Veronica is going to answer. Uh, why are you eating pineapple? Pineapple. Pineapple. Very good. I am eat pineapple. Eating pineapple? Uh-huh. Uh, after lunch. After lunch. Okay, you may I mean it's acceptable. There you go. Thank you, Michelle. Now, Veronica, read your question. Why are you going to the park? Why are you going to the park? Hmm, okay, cool. Let me see who can answer to this question. And everybody's like, like, with the camera's off. 
I mean, the ones that are participating that the camera is up. Jorge Alberto, can you answer the question? Okay. All right, all right. Uh, where are you swimming ah, right now? Now, nah, nah, Jorge, answer the huh? question that Veronica uh, read. Primero, responda okay. la, no, la pregunta de Verónica. Okay, Verónica, repeat the question. Why are you Let's going go. to... Please. Jorge? Uh, where are you going? To the park. No lo escucho muy bien. Why are you going to where the are park? You going? Okay, why are you oh, okay. going to the park? Uh, I am going to the park. Mm -hmm. Because I am going to the park because I like it okay. playing. Okay, cool. Playing basketball. All right, perfect. That's cool, man. That's cool. Thank you, Veronica, for okay. the question. Now, Jorge, read the question yeah. and uh, and give me one second. Who got? Ah, Julio Alberto is going to answer. Teacher, lo siento, era del trabajo. No problem, Julio. Yeah, I mean, I, I understand. Okay, gracias. Okay, Jorge, read the question and Julio is answering. Okay. Where are where are you swimming right now? Okay. The question literally no was where, where are you swimming right now? No, no sé si solo yo le escuché así, Tich. No, okay. es que creo que se tenía un problema. Diferencia. Creo que está teniendo uh -huh. problemas con el internet, pero la pregunta era, where are you swimming uh -huh. right now? Swimming. Swimming, 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 the swimming. action. When you go to the, to the beach, when you go to a lake. Oh, okay, the nadar. Exactly, exactly. Uh -huh. Where are... Uh -huh. Where are you swimming right now? Donde está nadando en estos momentos? Uh, I am swimming. Uh -huh. Beach La Libertad. <laughs> in? In Beach La Libertad. <laughs> in La Libertad Beach. Okay, cool, man. That's, that's, that's a cool one. Quisiera, man. That's a cool Quisiera, man. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my God. Yeah, me, me too. Me too. Y eso que yo los tengo, y eso que yo tengo una playa 45 minutos de acá, man. Y, y la última vez que fui fue hace como, ¿qué? 2020. Yeah, man, like two years. Ya un poco más de dos años. Ya me toca ir. Me toca ir semanal, pero solo a ver, no puedo hacer nada. I mean, at least you go, uh, por lo solo menos pasar. va, man. Por lo menos va. I, have never, I, ha I haven't gone, man. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, from here, el espino is very close from, from here. Acá está un poco cerca, man. El, 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 la playa, el espino. 30 minutos tengo los cóbanos, yo. Yeah. <laughs> Arena Blanca. That's cool, man. Hey, pero no es esa la playa eh, peligrosa que dicen. No, donde, donde salen las ballenas es nada más. <ríe> no, ahí es, es tranquilo, es tranquilo. Uh, ah, así, <ríe> solo hay piedras, muchas piedras. Eh. Así dicen, así dicen que en los lugares, ¿verdad? cuando vamos entrando. <ríe> Aquí es tranquilo, Tiche. Yes, man, y salimos sin zapatos. Ok, right. no, no, no. Ok, let's continue. Let's continue with this. Uh, ok, Julio, now, 
I want you to read your okay. question and Jose Pineda is going to try to answer. Okay, Jose, what are you having for dinner? Jose. Hola. Me copio, Jose. No. <coughs> What are what you uh -huh. what are you having for dinner? What are you having for dinner? The orders. No, in this case, what are you having for dinner? I am. It's basically, it's basically what you need or what you are planning to do on dinner. The food, the food. Okay, for example, for example, Jose, listen. Like in that case, in the question, what are you having for dinner? You might say, I am having beans for dinner. I am having pizza for dinner. I am having tacos for dinner. I am having pupusas for dinner, for example. Right? I am having. Uh -huh. Now mention the food. Pizza. Pizza. Yes. Okay, I am having pizza for I, dinner. I am having and having pupusas. Uh -huh. dinner. Wow. Okay, pupusas for dinner. There you go. For dinner. Okay, cool. I am having pupusas for dinner. That is one. That, that, that one is a cool one. Okay, that's nice. Okay, Jose. Now read the question and I'm gonna try to answer. Yes. Uh -huh, read the question. You lost the question? Ahorita, ahorita. Okay. Ahorita, what time are you sleep this day? Sleeping these days. Sleep this day. Ah, okay. All right. I am sleeping at 10 30 these days. Okay. I am sleeping at 10 30 these days, right? So that would be like 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 one answer. Cool also. Now, Jonathan, can you please read your question? Como era la pregunta, teacher? Huh? Como era? No, nah, I mean read the question that you have. The question that you have is interesting, man. Read it. La mía. Yes. Are we do justice? Justice, justice. That's the question. That's the word. Uh -huh. Are we doing justice? Yes, we are doing justice. Okay, esa sería la respuesta a su pregunta, Jonathan. Okay. 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 So if that were in negative, in negative. Okay. All right. Now. What are we going to do like right now, people? Listen up. Uh, basically, we were, you know, discussing, you know, the structure to ask the questions and all those things. We were practicing some examples and everything. But now, I don't, I mean, I don't really want to stay only with, you know, the, the questions and answers, but I want we to practice these things. Listen up. That's why in here in page 
Perry and something, I'm gonna write down the, the number of this. Give me one second. Now, okay, yeah, I mean, it's this. Let's go to the page 33. Vamos a la página 33 del manual. If you have them written down on there, print it out. Okay. And in here, you will find out, listen up, a short conversation related to this thing that we have been discussing. Okay. Acá tenemos una pequeña conversación en la cual le estamos usando el presente continuo. Okay. This said, listen to the teacher. All right. Lord, listen to your teacher. Read the conversation, then practice with a partner. Okay. Igual, la misma dinámica. Vamos a leerla en dos ocasiones. Al final, si tienen alguna pregunta con vocabulario, uh, all right, just, just let me know. Okay. This is a conversation between Rose and Mary. All right. It says, uh, Rose. Hello, Mary. Hello, Mary. What are some activities? What are some activities? You are doing this week. You are doing this week. It says Mary. Hi, Rose. Hi, Rose. It says, well, well, there are many things. There are many things I am doing this week. I am doing this week. For example, for example, I am signing some payroll, I mean payrolls. I am signing some payrolls, right? On Tuesday, on Tuesday. And sending emails on Wednesday. All right, and sending emails on Wednesday. And you, he says, and you, okay. In that case, he says, that's okay. That's okay. I am talking to colleagues. I am talking to colleagues and Checking reports and checking reports. It says Mary. And who and who is analyzing the advances? And who is analyzing the advances in the company? In the company. And it says, Rose, Peter is, Peter is, okay, in here, people, do you have any question, okay, related to the vocabulary that we got in there? Payroll, ¿qué es, teacher? Okay, payrolls es, viene siendo como una nómina, okay, especialmente... <laughs> Una nómina especialmente, bueno, cuando hablamos en empresas, sería una nómina de donde aparece el, el monto que se les paga a los trabajadores. Creo que se le llama nómina de sueldo. Ya, yeah, I mira, mean, ese payroll. Donde aparece todo los, el payment. Right, Teacher, que es signing. Signing. Firmando. Firmar. Firmar. Ah, ok. Ok, pero en este caso sería firmando. Firmando, ajá. Ajá, sí, el ING. Das, sí, firmar. firmar, ok. Thank you, teacher. No, ok, cool. Son ¿Cómo son? Sí, ok, ok, ok. One, one, one in a moment. Uh, na, 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 na. José, ¿qué dices? Sí. Tú, oye, oye, ¿Cómo ah, se ah, pronuncia? Este. Colleagues. Colleagues. Colleagues means colegas de trabajo. Ok. Ok. Very good. Gracias. Ok, cool. Uh, let's see. Jonathan. 
la que dice análisis de avance. Ok, let me see. Ah, and who is analyzing the advances? Ok, literally says, and who is analyzing the advances in the company? Ah, ¿y quién está analizando los avances en la compañía? Ok, right. teacher. Very good. Teacher, me repite Ay. después de donde dice Cine, Cine, Son, Ok, give me Facebook, es el, es el siguiente. I am, ah, uh, this one, I am signing, signing, I'm signing. signing some signing payroll. Some payrolls. Oh, okay. Exactly. Payrolls. Ah, estoy firmando una nómina de, right, sueldos o pagos, in that case. That's what it says. Pro, any other, profe, any other word? En, en la unión de many things. Okay, cool. Let me see. Ahorita le vemos. Many things. Well, there are many things many I am things. doing this week. Uh, like many things says make muchas cosas. Okay, any other word? Alguna otra palabra que tengamos dudas? O pronunciación o everything is okay up to now o todo está bien hasta acá no, ok if everything is okay all right we're gonna do the same as always all right vamos a ir a practicar esta conversación por cinco minutos luego volvemos a la sala principal ok la case exchange roles let's remember ok just to confirm solo para confirmar José Edgar uh, and Wendy and uh, Jorge, are you in your house? I'm here, teacher. Estamos. Okay, hmm? cool, cool. There you go. Let's continue then. Jose Elga, are you there? Because I didn't listen to you, man. Hmm. Okay, I think Jose is not there. So we're going to be having 13. Give me one second. No, it's in here. Yeah, 15, 14, I'm gonna make the, okay, seven. I'm gonna make six. And I'm gonna put Edgar into one group. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, ladies. Okay, let's go to work, guys. You got the, the breakout room opens. Let's go to practice. Oh, está bien corto. Vamos a ver. Ahí está. Ay. Bye. Eh, dice, solo me regala la página de nuevo. Ah, ok. No hay problema. Ahorita se la pongo. Creo que se me sale. Página. Le va, a tomar le, va, ¿Le va a tomar captura o...? Oh, oh. Es que tengo el, tengo el manual, pero en, la, en, en el teléfono. Entonces... Ah, ok, no problem, no problem. Oh, es página yeah. 33, page 33. Ya, yeah, mi Carlos lo acaba de mandar también. Sí, ya lo mandaron el teléfono. Ahí está. Aquí está. Yes. Ok, si quiere, comenzamos. Démosle. Vale. Si quiere, comienzo yo. Hello, Mari. What are some activities you are doing this week? 
five rows. Well, there are many things I, I am doing this week. For example, I am singing song quiet on Thursday and sending email on Wednesday. Are you? And you? That's okay. I am talking to colleagues, to two colleagues, and checking Hello. reports. And who, is, and, checking reports. and who is? Uh, what? What are some activities you are doing this week? Activities. Hi, hi, Rosen. Wait, there are many times in the, in Andoy. This week, for example, I am signing, 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 signing some, signing some payroll on Tuesday, Tuesday, and, Tuesday and, and sending send email so. on on. Sí, tengo WhatsApp, pero no me ha llegado. <laughs> Ay, qué barbaridad. What's up, Wendy? What happened? ¿Qué pasó? Yo no tengo la... <laughs> no tengo eh, la conversación. Ah, no problem. Ahorita le voy a tomar una captura. Ok, se lo voy a proyectar. Vaya, pues, por favor. There you have. <laughs> Ahí Vaya, está. compañero, yo soy Rosy. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Good day. There are many things I'm doing this week. For example, I am signing some payroll. 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 Oh. Pay Ross on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. Wednesday day and you. Thanks. Okay, I am talking to college and checking checking report report report. Mm -hmm. uh, cool. Uh, is analyzing the uh, advance. Analyzing the advances. Analyzing the advances in the company. Peter is. Okay. Okay. Peter. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay, Wendy. Okay. Take a screenshot. Because I had to, you know, stop sharing and move on to another group. Okay, gracias. Gracias, bye bye. teacher. Okay, cool. Nice. Hello, bye. Marie. Bye. Teacher, we're finished. Ah, you're finishing? Nice. Yeah, I'm fin Perfect, man. I'm going to be checking all the groups and then we're going to come back, okay? Okay, okay. teacher. Cool. Uh, who is announcing the events in the company? Peter E. Okay. Miss Hello, Marie. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are. Vaya. Entonces, empieza de nuevo. Usted empieza de nuevo. Okay. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to college and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advance in the company? Peter is. 
Ok. Ah, teacher, aquí está el teacher. Ajá. Teníamos una duda con la palabra analyzing. Bueno, yo, yo lo estoy pronunciando analyzing, pero yo no sé si es correcto. Analyzing. Ya, yeah, I mean. Analyzing. Analyzing. Ya, yeah, that's the one. Ah, yes, okay. Yeah. Okay. ok. Esa era la duda que teníamos. Ah, ok, no problem. Hoy empiezo yo, Verónica. Hello, Mary. Ok. What are you? Okay. I am 30 the colleges and the checking reports. And who is announcing the advice in the company? Peter is. Okay. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Ross. There are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am sitting some playrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to collage and checking report. And who is analyzing the advances in the company? Peter is. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am sending some payouts on Thursday and sending email on Wednesday. And you? Thanks. Okay. I am taking the colleges and checking report. And who is announcing the mind in the company? Peter is. Okay, all right, very good. I think we have practice enough, so let's go back to the main section. In there, I want to listen to you all, okay? Okay. Nice. Okay, let's go. Like what happened with the rest? I mean, it's just seven people coming. ¿Qué pasó con los demás? Okay. Okay. <laughs> nah, man. O, o todavía están practicando o están esperando que lo saquen. No hay nada, cabrón. Ah, yeah, I mean, they are coming, you see? Eso estaba pasando. Hoy oh, terminamos el tiempo, teacher. Yeah. Ah. Están perdidos en el tiempo, Leo. <laughs> exactly. Okay, cool. No, man, I'm going to project this and, and uh, all right, Soyla, let's be the ones from the first one. Give me one second. ¿Dónde está el manual? Okay. Mm -hmm. Or si terminemos cabal, teacher, please. <laughs> We're gonna be doing that, okay? No problem. 939, man. It's just, it's, it's, there is plenty of time yet. Today, I can't, man. 25 minutes. All right. Let's do it, Saila. Vaya. Vaya, Julio. Comienza usted. I see. I <laughs> see, Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I, I am doing this week. For example, I am singing some period on Thursday and sending email on Wednesday. And you? Thanks. Okay. I am talking to colleagues to and the checking reports. 
And who mm -hmm. is announcing the advice in the company? Peter is. Now, okay, cool. Thank you, Julio. So, like, you did it great. Now, let's move uh, with the other ones. Mm, William, who are you working with? Eh, con Veronica. Now, okay, cool. Let's go. Comience, Veronica. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to colleagues and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advance in the company? Peter is. Ah, okay, very good. Thank you, William and Veronica. Carlos Gamero, who were you working with? To the group, the three. Ah, okay. Jonathan, conmigo. Ah, okay, cool. Jonathan, okay. you and me. All right, cool. So, Carlos, let's start practicing with LP, then LP with Jonathan, okay? Okay, teacher. Cool, let's go. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rob. Well, there are many things I'm doing this week. For example, I am signing some payroll on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to colleagues and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advance in the company? Peter is. Okay. okay. Jonathan. Jonathan. Hello, Hello. Mari. After the comienzo. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many times mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I am doing the week. For example, I am signing some payroll on Tuesday and sending a mail on Wednesday and you. That's okay. I am talking to a college and checking reports. I work in the analysis the abounds Peter is. in the company. Peter is. Okay, cool. There you go. So thank you, Carlos, Elvi, and Jonathan. You did it excellent. Now, let's move on. Mm -hmm. Michelle. Let's go, Michelle. Um, teacher, creo que no la veo. Conmigo. Ah, ahí está. Oh, my, my God, Michelle. Okay, okay, empiezo. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am seeing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending the mails on Wednesday, and you? That's okay. I am talking to collect and checking report. Police. And who is announcing the advance in the company? Peter is. Peter is, okay. Very good. So that's excellent, Michel, and uh, let me see. Ivania, right? Okay, now let's move. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, who's the other one? Uh, Wendy. Hola. All right, who are you working with? Hola, Wendy. Con Jose. Oh. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's do it. Hello, Mari. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things and I am doing this week. 
for example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? Yes. Okay. I am checking the to call it and chicken report. And who is Alice? Anal, ¿Cómo se pronuncia esto, Juan? Analyzing, analyzing. Analyzing, eh, analyzing the advance. Analyzing. analyzing the advance in the company. Peter is. Peter is, all right. The, the, the question, the, the answer, I mean, the pronunciation for that is analyzing, right? With A. Analyzing, analyzing, okay. Analyzing. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Wendy. And uh, who was the other one? Ah, Jose. Okay, cool. Who's missing? Mm -hmm. Jorge Alberto, right? And uh, who are you practicing? It was with Carlos, right? Yeah. Okay, where's Carlos? I am Carlos. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Uh, Jorge, empiezo yo dos. Sí. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to college and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advance in the company? Peter is. Peter is. Okay, cool. That's nice. Thank you, Carlos and Jorge. Let me see who else is missing. I think all of you have already participated, right? Creo que todos estamos, ya participamos. Let me see. Yeah, Elvi has already won. Uh, uh, okay. Everybody has already participated. Okay. Now, what are we going to do besides this part, people? Listen. Teacher. Yes. Me acabo de conectar yo. Podría leer la oración con alguien. I am in. Hey, good man, Gilberto. Que se me cayó el inter. <laughs> okay, cool. That's nice, man. Let me see. Solo voy. Okay, Soyla, let's go. Ayúdenme, por favor. Sí, eh, tomen la chat de Rose. Usted, Soyla. Okay. Bye. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Ross. Well, there, there are many things I'm doing this week. For example, I am singing Signing? song payroll. Payroll. Um, pay, pay. Okay, payrolls. Payroll. On Thursday and sending email on when, Wednesday. Wednesday. Uh -huh. Wednesday and you. That's okay. I am talking to college and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advances in the company? Peter is. Okay, Peter is. Thank you, Gilberto. Soy like you did an excellent. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, okay, Soyla. Okay. All right, now let's go down, people. Let's go down. I want to go to this section. Look, in this part over here, it says, fill in the blanks with the events you have at your workplace. These events are the things that you got in here. For example, it says, signing payrolls. Sending emails, analyzing uh, the advantage or advantages in this case. Advantages. Okay, what other events you might have in your workplace? ¿Qué otros eventos o qué otras actividades ustedes suelen hacer? Okay, en su trabajo. Ah, entonces quiero que me llenen estos cuadros acá con las actividades que ustedes por lo general hacen. Okay, ¿qué es lo que vamos a hacer acá? Si ustedes van a escribir. Ah, por ejemplo, escribir reportes, ¿cómo lo harían? Writing reports, ¿ok? Writing reports. 
El verbo tiene que ir en ing, ¿ok? Like the ones that you have in there, como los que tenemos ahí en ejemplo, ¿ok? Let's go for it. Teacher, yo ya yes. lo había hecho. Ah, ok, perfect. If you have it Se lo digo way, para ver si está bien. Yes, man, read it. Ok. Eh, talking to collect. Eh, okay. Checking my email. Ok. Eating fruit. Fruits, ok. Eh, signing checks. Signing checks, very good. Talking my boss. Talking to my boss. Ah, aquí me falta to, to my boss. Y drinking a lot of water. Drinking a lot of water. That's what you mean? Sí. Sí. Ah, drinking. ok. Very good. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Perfect. Okay. ok. Vamos a esperar a los demás entonces. Okay, let's finish then. If you have any questions, just let me know, okay? Sure. Yes. Signing significa firma. Firmar. Firmar. Yes. Entonces, dos oraciones con. No, no, con no. En, sin, no, no. En, no, no. Lo que me va a hacer en, en esos recuadros, si ve, hay unos que dicen 4, 5 hasta el 9. ¿Ok? Sí. Ahí lo yes. que usted me va a colocar son las actividades que usted suele hacer en su trabajo. Ah, ok. okay. Si es escribir reportes, me va a escribir writing reports. Si es ah. enviar correos, me correos, va a poner, ah, sending send emails. Ah, email. ah, ok, aquí lo tenemos ya, sending emails. Entonces, estos son a modo de ejemplos para que usted llene los demás. Así ah, ok, ok. Ahí, dice. Okay. Okay. Teacher, ¿Sí? eh, formulario, ¿cómo se dice? Como firmar formularios. ¿Quién me va a hacer? ¿Cómo se llama el grupo? Es Forms, Forms. F-O-M-R. No, F-O-R-M. Form. Form. F-O-R-N. Form, ok. Form. Sign, sign in the sign in the form. Finished, teacher. Ah, okay, cool. You can start reading, William. Uh, send the emails, ready, reading the report, 
Okay. Calling the clients. Meeting with my boss. Signing the forum. Mm -hmm. Visit the companies. Okay. Yeah, very good. Thank you, William. Teacher. Visiting clients, checking okay. emails, answering the phone, making invoice, sending emails, speaking with the customer, eating lunch. Eating lunch. All eating right, lunch. Very, good. very good. Thank you, Andy. No, okay, Soila. Writing reports, uh -huh. checking, checking my email, doing, doing reports. Mm -hmm. Sending the report, meeting okay. my boss, uh, reading analysis. Reading analysis. Ah, okay. Revisando. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Soila. All right, who else has finished? What? Who else has finished? ¿Quién más ha terminado? Let me know when you finish. Yeah. Okay, read it. Uh, prepare the samples. Drafting right. the drafting the status. Printing the documents. Okay. Delivering box. Mm -hmm. Sending emails. Perfect. Creating the report. Now, okay, nice. Thank you, Ivania. Well, I finished. Teacher, yo hice unas. Ok. Let's read them. Veanlas. Ok. Uh, going to meeting. Ajá. Uh -huh. Calling clients. Calling clients. Okay. Clients. Uh, Drawing reports. Ok. Uh, sending emails. Perfect. A driven driver uh, advice uh, sending sending reports to my boss. Ah, okay, sending reports to my boss. Very good. Thank you, Julio. What well, has finished? Has you must? Good teacher. No, okay, what are you? The sending emails, uh -huh. writing the reports, okay. uh, eating the breakfast, okay. uh, talking the customers, okay. uh, checking reports. And checking reports, very good. Okay. Perfect. What about the other ones? Is it mass? Are you about to finish? Tengo lo mío, teacher. Así están bien. Okay, Gilberto, let's read them. I check email. Okay. Ah, I check. bring. Okay, checking emails in that case. I checking, I checking email. Okay, en ese caso, en ese caso eliminemos el I. Solamente. Ah, solo check, check, solo checking. Ajá, exactly. Checking email. Check, checking email. Very good. El otro, entonces el siguiente sería printing traveler. Exactly. Printing traveler. I don't know what file. Ah, uh, repeat again. Uh, como descargar archivo. Ah, I download. Okay, downloading 
Don't let Don't him. Lo Don't lo adding uh -huh. file. Files. files, okay, files. Don't let him file, okay. Don't let him file. Sending email. Okay. Office, office working order. Mm. Repeat again. Office, office working order. Okay, it will be working in order in the office. See? Okay, working in order See? in the office. I I gather my com companion. I okay, repeat again. I didn't listen that much that one. Como decir, me reúno con mis compañeros. Ah, I gather with my colleagues. Oh, my okay. in that case, gathering with my colleagues. Ah, okay. Okay, I see you. Ah, okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay, Gary. All right, gathering. Don't quito. Venga, sí. Ya lo voy a sacar. Vamos. Don Quito ya para la calle. Don Quito ya quería a la calle. <laughs> okay, cool, man, cool. Yes, man, it's time to get out to Don Quito. That was funny, the name of the dog. Okay, cool. Let's continue. Let's continue. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Aaron. That's funny, man. El próximo nombre del perrito lo vamos a poner así, Duncan. Dame, Duncan, es la, es right. Okay, cool. Uh, let me see, who has finished? Mich Ana Michelle fue la primera. Yeah, me. Uh, yeah, William has already participated. Ivania too. José Edgar is still on the way home. Verónica. ¿Por qué se me hace que Verónica no ha participado? <laughs> no. I am in your so quiet, right? Okay, cool. Let's do it. Um, doing sport activities, reading reports, okay. having meetings, psychological attention, sending emails, and planning programs. Planning programs. Okay, very good. All right. Those are like the most common things, right? That we have been doing. Okay, cool. Now, we're going to end up with that because I think most of you have already participated. Creo que sí, ahora sí ya todos participamos en esta parte. Uh, by tomorrow, we're going to continue with that. But, yeah, para mañana sí ya tenemos una parte de lectura. Mañana sí vamos a leer, people. Yes. Y vamos a contestar un par de preguntitas si es verdadero o falso. Listen up. Para mañana tenemos esto. Pero si pueden darle una leída mañana durante el día, Sería mucho más que excelente, ¿ok? Para saber más o menos de qué va a tratar la lectura de la cual vamos a estar hablando mañana, ¿ok? That's going to be like a topic, ¿ok? Related to, let me see some questions. Let me see. Read this article about the activities to keep employees happy. Ah, es una actividad que dice que es para eh, básicamente enseñar a cómo mantener a los empleados Felices. Así para un aumento, ¿verdad? Cada mes. Ahí sí, más felices. Pero ni es. No problem. So, in that case, si tienen tiempo y pueden darle una leída, it will be excellent for you, ¿ok? Sería más que excelente. Así mañana, pues, ya más o menos traemos qué, eh, de qué se trata el artículo, ¿ok? Y si no, pues aquí lo vamos a leer, ¿ok? No problem with that. All right. Let's remember tomorrow is. Thursday, if I'm not wrong. So two more classes if we are going to be finishing this, you know, like this, this, this week. Okay. So I'm going to stop sharing this thing and I am going to pass the attendance list. Give me one second. No, no, no. Uh, Carlos Mauricio. Present. Teacher. Cool. Este, este solo, solo que ma mañana solo va a estar de oyente que tengo salida del trabajo a la medianoche. Ah, ok. 
Ah, ok, ok, man. No problem. That's gonna be hard working, man. Cool. A la MC Cindy didn't show up. Elvi Quintanilla. Good night, teacher. Ok, cool. Stephanie Michelle. Present. Ah, ok, cool. Let me see, Gustavo Adolfo. No and... escucho si acaso por mí. <laughs> yes. Ya, Michelle, ya. Ivania Jamilet. Present. Present, teacher. Aquí okay. estoy. <laughs> yeah, Michelle. <laughs> sí, Michelle, ya rato lo escuchamos. No problem, ok. Ya te escucharon. Jorge Alberto. <laughs> Present teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, cool, Jorge Alberto. Jose Antonio. Present. Okay, cool. Jose Edgar. I am in there. Uh, Juan Emanuel. He didn't show up today. Uh, Juan Gilberto. Present teacher. Perfect. Uh, no, 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 Alberto. Julio Alberto. Present teacher. Okay, Julio Cesar. All right, Julio Cesar didn't show up today, right? Karen Beatriz didn't show up today. Luis Gerardo. Luis. That was crazy, man. Verónica Arely. Present. Hey, Verónica. Como hay una fila que no ha venido, <ríe> bueno, que no se presentaron ahora, all right? uh, así que a usted le va a tocar los 10 minutos de feedback ahora, ¿ok? Ok. Usted es la, la más próxima. Ok. Let me see. Give me one second. Um, Wendy Yamilet. Ana no, Wendy. Ana I mean, Ming Wendy has, 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 has are going out. William Ernesto. Present teacher. Okay. Good night. Good night. Xiomara Elizabeth. Xiomara. Hey, Xiomara. Damn it, she's gone already. Uh, Luis Jonathan. Luis Jonathan. What? Carlos Jose. Man, these people. Where is, where is these people? En Soy la Guadalupe. Man, well, like okay, cool. <laughs> Let's see you tomorrow, people. Have a wonderful night, okay? Bye bye. See you. Bye, teacher. Okay, good night. Uh, good night, everybody. Today was one of those weird classes, man. At the end. Good night, teacher. Good night, Gilberto. Have a wonderful night. Bye bye. All right. Now, I mean, everybody got problems with the internet today, man. Casi todos tuvieron problemas de conectividad esta noche. Bueno, hay algunos que están enfermos, otros que. Man, that's, that was crazy, man. That was crazy. I, I just ended up with, what, como con cuatro o cinco. That was crazy. Okay, but anyways, right? No problem. Okay, cool. Uh, as you know, Veronica, this is going to be just 10 minutes. Estos 10 minutos son básicamente para aclarar cualquier duda que usted pueda tener con relación a esta clase o las clases anteriores que hemos tenido. So, I don't know if you have any questions related to that or something related to the platform. Fíjense que no creo que hasta el momento he comprendido la mayoría de cosas. Quizás, no sé si me escucha. Yes, yes, I'm listening to you. Olis. Se me aparizó Olis. Are you listening to me? Ahora sí. Ahora sí. Okay. Ah, ok, cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm listening to you. So, hasta ahora vamos comprendiendo todo. Ajá, quizás, bueno, me costó un poco lo de has to y need to, quizás porque, bueno, al, al final entendí que quizás depende del contexto, ¿verdad? Nah, no sé si ajá. estoy, ajá. Si estoy en lo correcto. 
sí, sí, en parte sí. Y hay otra, hay otra cosa, una gran diferencia es que una expresa obligación, la otra expresa necesidad. Ajá, ajá. Depende Pero de digamos que no hay como una, no hay como una regla o algo de cuál, cuándo debe ser have to y cuándo debe ser eh, need to, ¿verdad? Ah, right, es correcto. Por eso le digo que la, la única opción ahí es que una expresa obligación y la otra expresa necesidad. ¿Ok? Ya una obligación uh -huh. y una necesidad, a veces son dos cosas muy diferentes. Right? ¿Ok? Mientras nosotros decimos, I need to eat to work good. Necesito comer para trabajar bien. So, en ese caso ahí, estamos hablando de una necesidad, right? Ok, uh -huh. cool. En sí. este caso, si yo digo, okay. I have to wear uniform in the school. Ah, tengo que usar uniforme en el colegio o en la universidad o en la escuela. So, en ese caso, ya estamos expresando una obligación. Ok, y ahí pues ya es algo que sí, mandatoriamente se uh -huh. tiene que hacer. Right? Entonces es la diferencia okay. como entre ellos. Al dos. principio tenía dudas, pero ya después lo fui, lo fui asimilando. Ah, okay. Okay. Perfecto. Eso y bueno, me surgió una duda también cuando hice la tarea de ayer porque me salieron mal a tus preguntas. A ver, este, a ver. En, cuando cuando es el simple present nunca lleva ing, verdad? O no nunca. A menos que vayan dos verbos juntos. Sí. A menos que vayan dos verbos juntos. Sí puede llevar ING. Vaya, como en el caso, mire. En este caso puede llevar ING. Mire, si yo tengo acá. El verbo like. Si tengo el verbo enjoy, que es disfrutar. Si tengo el verbo mmm, love. Si tengo el verbo hate, que es odiar. Ok, y hay entre otros verbos. Ok, estos verbos, si tenemos otro verbo después de estos, dos verbos no pueden ir juntos. No, no pueden ir en forma base, o sea, en su forma original. Ajá, ajá los sí, dos. comprendo. Por lo general, el segundo se tiene que modificar. El segundo tiene que ponérsele, ya sea un infinitivo, agregándole tú al verbo, o se puede colocar en gerundio, o sea, con ING. Un ejemplo uh -huh. claro de ello. Si yo digo, I like listen, listen es el verbo. Pero uh -huh. acá, como lo tengo después de like, a mí me obliga una regla a ponerle ING. Y luego to music. I like listening to music. Me gusta escuchar música. Acá, a pesar de que lleva un verbo en ING, no significa que sea presente continuo. ¿Ok? Aquí no. Ajá. Es simple el present. Es presente simple, tal y como está. I like listening to music. Me gusta escuchar música. ¿Ok? I enjoy traveling. You see? Ah, disfruto viajar. You see? I enjoy traveling. ¿Ok? O oh, I love teaching English. Ah, me encanta. Ok, enseñar inglés. You see? Por lo general acá el verbo teach va con ING. Otra, let me see. She hates, ella odia. She hates work es el verbo. Ahora bien, pero como llevamos hate, vamos a ponerlo en ING. She hates working until late. Ella odia trabajar hasta tarde. You see? So, en este caso acá, working, básicamente tiene que ir con ING porque tenemos el verbo have. Or, uh -huh. I mean, hate. Or okay. Hate. Entonces, sí, así es como podemos usar, ok, el, ok, gerundio como presente simple. Cuando hay dos verbos. Exactamente, juntos. exactamente. Sí. Es que me salió mal a la de They are swimming now. Ya le puse que era 
presente simple, pero, pero fue creo porque me adelanté a esa clase con esa tarea, entonces ya luego entendí que, que era presente continuo. Ah, ok, pero igual, si, si le salió mal, puede volverle a intentar, ok, y para que le pueda salir bien. Ajá. Y en la pregunta, what are you doing? ¿Es presente simple o es continuo? Continuo. What are you doing? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Ajá, ok. Continuo. Vaya, como las dos dudas que tenía. De ahí creo que he ido comprendiendo. Ah, ok. Perfecto, perfecto. Uh -huh. Me alegro de escuchar eso. Yeah, I mean, you have been like, like paying attention to everything. You have been participating. Así que sí. I was pretty sure that everything was clear on you. Sí, estaba prácticamente seguro que todos estábamos claros okay. con eso. Yeah, I mean, you have been participating and your participations are excellent all the time. So we don't have any, any, any problem on that, okay? Cool. ¿Algo más que, 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 que pueda surgir como duda, Veronica? ¿O todo está bien hasta acá? Mm. No, creo que solamente era eso. De ah. ahí todo. <laughs> Ah, ok, cool. Perfecto, entonces. Bien, si es siendo así, entonces ya no le quito más su tiempo, right? Y nos tiempo vemos... de sueño. Exactly, right? Exactly. Y nos vemos mañana, ok, en otra videoconferencia, ok? Hablo okay. de Night, Verónica, ok? Que duerma bien. Bye bye. Buenas noches. Ok, bye. Bye.